So I lit the bottle rocket, and it shot it, with the weight. I, I didn't think much. So like it, with the weight of this this grasshopper, it wasn't able to do the exact you know like. Oh boom. my god! So it shot like that over, and my mom was coming out of the front door of the house at the time, and the bottle rocket proceeded to hit the door in front of her and blow up right on the other side. Um, I don't know if the grasshopper was a part of that explosion or if it managed Did to Did she escape. know there was a grasshopper in there? Um, no. No, she didn't. Did she ever see the remains of the grasshopper? No. No one No one knows what happened to that grasshopper. and It, uh, it got fucking well, we disintegrated. I know. Lived, I, uh, I know. It, he could have jumped off halfway yeah. through flight. I he mean, he could have survived. Long, what did you use to, hi- to yeah. tie it on there? Uh, tape. You don't think that tape would have held? Uh, it's, I think it did. Do you think a grasshopper <laughs> would have been able to break tape? What I don't kind know. Of tape? It depends. It was scotch just a tape. Scotch it's got to be a strong yeah. grasshopper. It was just scotch a real tape. strong grasshopper. He was a heavy yeah. grasshopper, too. Ooh, but anyway, <laughs> so that was the first time my fireworks got Why didn't you fuck with something more your size, like a praying mantis or something like that? So the other you time, I, I, I actually made a homemade bazooka. I think I've told this story before. I don't I don't know. Did but you hit a praying mantis with it? No. I, I shot my oh, sister with it. Oh, that's much better. Yeah. So it was actually, this was the most accurate shot i actually got this big tube this big cardboard tube and i i out of my creativity i created a site for it where i got a toothpick so i stuck like one toothpick and then i did one like this and then like this 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 and then a crosshair in the middle so i made a little scope out of mm. out of some toothpicks and scotch tape so there's just tape everywhere and this thing and i'd have my brother load the bottle rocket on the back and light it and I'd aim it, and one time my sister was standing out there, and I yelled at her, and I aimed it. I didn't think it was going to hit her. It hit her right in the leg. It's about a 50-yard shot. Blew up. I like, got my fireworks confiscated again. So, yeah. Were you training to, like, if the United States got invaded at some point, and you had to, like, shoot him with a bottle rocket. He was going to defend his own land with, like, a homemade bazooka that shoots out some sort of shrapnel. Is like... Was that your thought process? Yeah, he's just like, being a I mean, little asshole, I was just like just he is <laughs> to this day. Still an asshole. A poor grass. Just trying to, just trying to, you know. Why didn't you fuck with a praying mantis? I've only ever seen one in my life. Really? In the wild, like I've seen them in. Like, Couldn't you get sued once upon a time for fucking with those? I think so. Yeah, well, probably. Praying mantis. Yeah, because they I were didn't. like. I uh, saw. It. Oh, there was a stick. I never saw. I've never seen a praying mantis in the wild, but I saw a stick. Stick insect or whatever. A wild praying mantis. That, how did you just f- fucking confuse the two? A stick. A stick thing and a fucking bring mantis. They're both cool. That's <laughs> <laughs> what they have it's, in common. They're both cool. They're, and they're both, both pretty cool. Insect. I remember parts. I see the first time I seen one, I threatened to step on it, and like whoever was with me was just like, "No, you like you'll get fucking arrested for that." I was like, "What the <laughs> hell?" Like I, I let it go. Like I didn't do anything, but like so you threatened a praying mantis. Uh, I thought it was a normal bug, like at the oh. time. Like I thought, like bugs are bugs. Like I'll kill it. I just find it funny that you like told it you were gonna step on it, like you threatened it, and then your friend oh, had to no. like talk you down. I was. For- I don't even know what. Th- Maybe I was being an asshole too, and I was just like, "Hey, I'm Sounds gonna kill right. this bug. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this bug. Come watch I had to, this." Like talk you down, like no, no, you can't kill that bug. Haven't you heard? Uh, it probably I probably was also told in like science or something like if you see these things don't uh, don't kill them. They I was are... never taught about that. I don't know. Maybe I was. I had this praying mantis that I kept for a little bit when I was younger, and I you're not I, supposed to I do gave that. Him a, a bunch of crickets to eat, and the crickets ended up eating the praying mantis. What the fuck? <laughs> what? You should be sued. You should be sued. Well, I mean, he's not much of a praying mantis if he it's eaten yeah. by his yeah, prey. Yeah, but you fucking put those things in there with it. <laughs> That was your fault! That was really weird. How much is the fine for a praying mantis? I'm fucking... <laughs> you're gonna fucking be held accountable for your actions. <laughs> you're what, 15 fucking, years you're ago? Stealing, you're, you're, <laughs> you're stealing hockey sticks, you motherfucker. <laughs> they weren't endangered They were broken hockey. and Doesn't not matter. wanted anymore. They, were they weren't property. endangered hockey sticks. I'm gonna look you up this fine. A, you committed a felony. <laughs> Let's he see. committed petty theft is pretty much what he committed. <laughs> a crime... Killing praying mantis, a crime carrying a fifty dollar fine as a punishment. <laughs> fifty dollars, motherfucker! You're I going want 50 down. Bucks right fifty dollars. You're I'm paying the, the one, state. I'm not the one that killed it, though. The crickets killed it. But you led to its you eventual death. You did that. You did that. You, you did what's true. even worse. You tortured it by leaving something that would eat it. That's like putting a rat in like a cage the and fuck? then putting like some kind How of like in insects to go I attack think it. That a cricket would like cric- a horde of crickets would turn. Okay, it's a, a horde of them. Try and go- <laughs> How many did you put in? I was like ten or something. Look at that! Like, yeah, what the hell? Oh my goodness! One versus ten. I don't know. 
fifty dollars fine, Alex. Yourself. How do you feel about I that? I think you should get fined fifty bucks for each cricket you have. I in was there. trying to save it. It was like it was in the middle of nowhere, and I was just trying to help it. I thought it was cool looking, so I was like, "Oh, I'll just keep it for a little bit and observe it." I'll give observe it some, its event, eventual I'll give death. It, some food <laughs> it actually like, says that it appears to be an urban legend. The whole praying mantis thing. I don't know like the doing. the charging and stuff. Yeah, I've uh, never heard of that before. I've, I've never either. heard of a. Why was I told this? I don't know. Because you fucking believed alligators were in your backyard. <laughs> <laughs> Why was I told that? I they... thought praying mantises were like plentiful and like. No, not... like I was told that they were endangered. Well, and, are they like, endangered? It would be a fine if you killed them. Like, Apparently, you get a fifty dollar fine. Fifty dollars at least. It's, I, it still says that I guess shit. I'll, so I guess I'll pay it, but you yeah, better fucking pay it. Where like were you a... at when you did this? Back in Massachusetts, I guess. You're paying the state 50 bucks. You're going back to fucking pay that and $50. And an extra 50 bucks per week, he didn't pay that 50 bucks. Oh, wow, that's. You're fucked. You're fucked. Ready to do some community service, Alex? I guess. Oh, I'm <laughs> a praying mantis. In truth, no such legal protection for the praying mantis exists. It is not <laughs> illegal to kill a praying, t- praying mantis of any I've, kind. I've never heard of that. Not any now. single state or federal law forbids you from killing a mantis. <laughs> Why did I fuck you? I've been living my whole life thinking I couldn't kill a praying mantis and I'll be charged money. Well, James, we'll ship a whole bunch of out here. You can kill them. But I'm not the only one. The thing is, God damn it. Every I've never fucking time it. this happens. I'm never the only one that thinks this. I'm not pulling this shit out of my ass. Like, other people believe this, too. Well, you know what so this means, right? Burn Hazel exists. Other people yeah. believe this. You know what this means. This right? was collected on the internet in 1999, Ooh, and it 99. says its, its status was false. There are a lot of things people believe that the majority <laughs> don't believe. You're gonna have to go back home, find that praying mantis you let go all those years He's ago. He's gonna be like sitting and there on the train, like. <laughs> Oh my God! For you, back. James. <laughs> the belief is that it's illegal to kill a praying mantis. Fifty dollar fine for a punishment has been floating around since the 1950s. We have no idea where this bit came from. It is not and has never been any federal or state law in terms of killing of, yeah, of the praying mantises. I'd never heard of that before. So there's certainly useful insects that are best left alone. But they're hardly an endangered. Sp- that wasn't true either. <laughs> they're not even endangered. Bugs are never endangered. No one cares about bugs. They like maybe because they're multiply. considered beneficial insects to have such an unusual posture. They're praying for gosh sake. People literally thought it was a crime to kill them. I've been living my whole life <laughs> with this lie. 